Do you have advice <laughs> for people uh, that want to, you know, get into programming, want to learn programming? You have a, a video, uh, what is programming new blessings, exclamation point. <laughs> and I think the top comment is like, warning, this is not for noobs. Uh, do you have a noob, <laughs> like uh, TLDW for that video, but also uh, a noob friendly advice on how to get into programming? You are never going to learn programming by watching a video called Learn Programming. The only way to learn programming, I think, and the only one is the only way everyone I've ever met who can program well yeah. learned it all in the same way. They had something they wanted to do, and then they tried to do it. And then they were like, oh, well, okay, this is kind of, you know, it'd be nice if the computer could kind of do this thing. And then, you know, that's how you learn. You just keep pushing on a project. <laughs> um, so the only advice I have for learning programming is go program. Somebody wrote to me a question like, we don't really, they're looking to learn about recurring neural networks. And he's saying like, my company's thinking of doing recur using recurring neural networks for time series data, but we don't really have an idea of where to use it yet. We just wanna like, do you have any advice on how to learn about, I, these are these kind of, of general machine learning questions. And I think the, the answer is <laughs> like, actually have a problem that you're trying to solve and and just i see that stuff oh my god when people talk like that they're like i heard machine learning's important could you help us yeah. integrate machine learning with macaroni and cheese production <laughs> you just i don't even you can't help these people like who lets you run anything who lets that kind of person run anything i think we're we're all um we're all beginners at some point so uh... it's not like they're a beginner it's it's like my problem is not that they don't know about machine learning. My problem is that they think that machine learning has something to say about macaroni and cheese production. Or like, I heard about this new technology. How can I use it for why? Like, yeah. I don't know what it is, but how can I use it for why? That's true. You have to build up an intuition of how, because you might be able to figure out a way, but like the prerequisites, you should have a macaroni and cheese problem to solve first. Exactly. Like, and then two, you should have more traditional, like in the learning process involve more traditionally applicable problems in the space of whatever that is of machine learning, and then see if it could be applied to micro At least start with, tell me about a problem. Like if you have a problem, you're like, you know, some of my boxes aren't getting enough macaroni in them. Um, can we use machine learning to solve this problem? Yeah. That's much, much better than how do I apply machine learning to macaroni and cheese?